Hello, my name is Chloe, welcome to my channel. Today I'm starting a video that is making me so happy and I can't wait to share it with you guys. So, today marks the, um, well yesterday technically, is four weeks until my secret flights to see Cole that no one really knows about. Um, Cole doesn't know I'm coming. A lot of my booktube friends don't know I'm going. <laughs> um, if you've stumbled across my channel through the long distance relationship community, hello, welcome. My name's Chloe. I normally talk about books, um, but I also know that gonna, there are going to be a few of you here who are here from the bookish content and we are finally getting the reunion vlog with Cole but it's happening three weeks before any of you guys actually think it's happening. So why am I putting myself through this? Um, the travel ban is dropping on the 8th of November um, and I will be there on the 20th. I have secret plans with his best friend to come and pick me up. The only people who know there are his best friend and his uncle because his uncle is my backup plan um, for a ride from the airport. I wanted to start filming this vlog today because I actually started packing my bag. I am so glad I'm going on two trips because Christmas presents for his grandparents and his uncle have um, filled my bag pretty much. My big suitcase does not have much space. Um, so yeah, I'm glad I'm going twice because I can take Christmas presents. I kind of didn't realise how much room they would take up, but yeah. I started packing my bag and I'm going to start with my like list of clothes to take. Again, if you're here from the bookish content, I'm gonna stick my audiobook on, which at the moment is The Water Cure, um, but I'm actually gonna search around in my library app to see what I've got, stick my headphones in, and plan out outfits. I will show you my list so far. Saying all this, if you want to skip through the video, I'm not gonna be offended. Um, again, if you've come from the long distance community to the booktube channel, I do reading vlogs every single week. I vlog every second of my life. So keeping this secret from my weekly reading vlogs has been really, really hard, which is why I wanted to start the vlog early and just document things that happen on my journey to getting out there. So I'm more than okay with people skipping through the video to find where we actually are reunited. I think this is gonna be a long one packing list okay ignore my bed i haven't made it yet today but this is the current journal i'm working in here we go here we go um passport and visa sweets and chocolate already packed i should tick that laptop charger phone and charger camera and charger kindle and charger pajamas pants and birth control is all that is on my list currently so I guess I will update you when this list is full and I can tick some things off because my suitcase is already in my wardrobe. Like that's where it lives anyway and it's already got stuff in. So I'm obviously not gonna pack outfits that I'm gonna want over the next month. It is still a month away, um, but I'm gonna switch back around to my face. But okay, what I'm saying is the travel ban has been in place for so long now that a month feels like a week. I've got so much prep to do, like so much prep. Um, not seeing your boyfriend in two years means everything is a little bit nerve-wracking, like he's actually gonna see me in person. I need outfits which are going to um, make me look good, pajamas that are gonna make me look good, um, you know, those sorts of things, just like stuff that I wouldn't really care dossing about here. Like today I'm wearing a grey t-shirt and grey shorts, I'm completely grey. I don't want to wear this while I'm there because I'll look like an idiot. Um, but yeah, I need to plan things, I need to plan what outfits, what's the word? I don't know the word I want. Anyway, audiobook and packing list is my next plan. So I just filmed a clip for last week's reading vlog, which you would have seen if you're a regular watcher of my channel. <sighs> I am very, very annoyed. And I couldn't tell you in that vlog why I'm annoyed. I'm gonna tell you now. And that is because the secret is out. Everybody in Cole's family, apart from him, knows I'm coming, which they're not supposed to know. <laughs> So I told his uncle because his uncle was going to be my backup plan to pick me up from the airport But it turns out that when I told his uncle his nan and granddad were still in the same room Non and pa already knew um, And then non slipped up because she didn't know it was a secret from Cole's dad because why would it be because she already knew So now Cole's dad knows so that means his stepmom knows which means everybody knows as long as they don't slip up and tell Cole it is the 11th right now and I go on the 20th. They do not have long to keep the secret. Let's hope they keep the secret, please. Update for the reunion vlog. 
it is 17 minutes to nine, very precise, and my COVID test is at nine. So I'm doing it with a company called Cured, uh, Q-U-R-E-D, uh, only because it was recommended to me. I didn't do much shopping around. I don't trust people. I don't know how this works, how it means it's any different than me just doing it myself, but okay, I've paid £35 for the privilege. And it is genuinely just the standard brand of COVID tests. This is just the up the nose one and I hate the just the up the nose one because I have a very, very sensitive nose and it will bleed. Um, but you know, you don't get to specify that you don't want those ones. Even when you just order some from the UK government, I have so many boxes of those that I don't like using. Um, but yeah, I'm just chilling, having a cup of tea. I mean, it means I can eat and drink, which you can't do with the throat one because you're swabbing your throat. Uh, so I guess I'm grateful for that. Oh, but I'm kind of stressed because what if this comes back positive? It's not gonna come back positive. I haven't had a positive test ever. I've been doing them every day and they've come back negative. The only person I've seen is the postman. So let's hope, let's hope. I will update you in about 25 minutes when I have results. So what you have to do is you have to insert approximately 1.5 centimeters mm -hmm. or this up until you feel the resistance from your nose. Okay. Now it has to be in circular motion. That's five times in each nose drill. Okay. okay. All right, go ahead, thanks. Hello, it is much, much, much later. And why has this happened before my trip? We will never know why these things happen. Anyway, did my COVID test this morning got my negative result that we knew I was going to get because I haven't actually been anywhere because I'm too scared of it being positive when I need to go and at lunch I went out and got my fake money so <laughs> or as Jesse calls this Jesse being the guy who's picking me up if I haven't actually mentioned that already um this is freedom this is he'll say how much is that in freedom if I tell him how much something is in pounds uh, so apparently this is freedom to me this is monopoly money um but yeah, I actually got a decent exchange rate, so I was really, really happy with that. <sighs> the time is going so slow today. I have a whole other day of work before my trip actually starts. I just want to wake up on Saturday morning. I mean, ideally, I'd like to wake up on the plane about to get off it, but um, I want to be there. This is so... Now I know I can go. My visa sorted. My test results sorted. I've got my COVID passport sorted. Like, I'm ready. Let me go. Nobody's outside. Oh, no. I don't see it. It's okay. I don't see anyone in the garage. 
I don't see anyone out no, there. No. Okay, okay, hold on. Okay. Yes, no, <laughs> 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 well, Dad was Dad's making bunya. Yeah, I told him to. <laughs> oh, well, that's weird. Have you ever had bunya? No, why don't he chose bunya? You can stop filming that. And there you have it. That was the secret. <laughs> I'm finding it really hard to talk right now. It is not even um, 5 a.m. on Tuesday which sounds like I'm gonna get this video up on time, but I forgot to think about the um, time difference. <laughs> so this video is now late. Me and Cole wanted to film an outro for you to show you everything that, like to show you us together, to talk about his reaction and things like that. Um, it's just not been possible with how the days have been going. Cole is still working. Um, so yeah, to get this video up on time, you're not getting an outro with Cole, but make sure you stick around for my weekly reading vlogs for the next, um, so number 59 and 60, because there will be a lot of Cole content. So make sure you are waiting around for those because he is in them. Um, and we will be doing the Q and A next time, I believe. So his reaction, I have had a lot of comments about his reaction, about how it didn't really look as like aggressive and passionate as some people thought it should be. You know, thanks for those comments. He was so shocked. He said it was like his bones disappeared from his body. Um, and he has said to me that he's very, very happy I'm here, but please never, ever do that again. Um, because he doesn't like surprises. Um, but he's very happy I'm here. I'm very happy I'm here and I'm having a lovely time. So we will find a better background as well. This is currently our setup as Cole was in between moving house. <laughs> so again, not a very convenient time for his bones to disappear on him. Um, but yeah, it is not even 5 a.m. He's gone to work. I need to finish getting this, uh, getting this video up. I'm sorry guys, I'm sorry it was late. I'm sorry it might not have been as amazing as you hoped, um, but I am so, so happy. And I would again like to thank all of you guys for your support over the past however long um, for well, just supporting me with missing Cole. And now I hope that you're happy for me that I'm not missing him anymore. So yeah. Um, that is all I have time for today. So thank you very, very much for watching this video. I really do hope you enjoyed and I will see you in my next one. Mm -hmm.